I would definitely advise uh, future students to begin early. Everyone says that, but yeah, that's uh, very useful. So where do you actually search for a room or an apartment? Uh, I would suggest starting with the Facebook groups, and I did that. But uh, a really good thing and a thing you have to put time in is Googling stuff. It's simple as that. Just go on Google, type in rentals in Groningen or apartments or rooms or whatever and just spend time on it. I would probably go through a whole bunch of different channels, look for a variety of websites and maybe also rental agencies. Uh, because it's probably not a good idea to only focus on one way to contact uh, owners. I know it can seem very tempting to go for, you know, the most uh, nicer looking locations, but the very hard truth is that getting a house in Groningen is already a complicated matter as it is. Be aware of scammers, because I got approached by a lot of people who exploit the fact that there is such a competitive market for housing, so to just be aware of Things like not paying a deposit before you've seen the room or being aware of location and stuff like that I think would be the most important. So if you find a room and you think that it's a nice place to live, go for it. You'll certainly be safer with going for a room than not finding a room whatsoever. I have a friend here that I met in Groningen and unfortunately for his first months here, uh, which were September and October, he had to live uh, from a hostel to another hostel, then moved to a hotel and even lived uh, one week in a tent, which is unbelievable and unbearable to hear, but unfortunately it happens. It's a long process. <laughs> It was a very um, nervous time in my life, um, being in school, dealing with a new environment, new people, and also having this problem hanging over my head all the time. I think currently the thing that makes it most difficult to find accommodation in the Netherlands is that there's actually a law uh, that prevents universities from offering housing to students themselves. So it's actually required by law that the student is held responsible to find their own accommodation. That's something that I didn't know during my first year, but I feel like it's quite important for people to understand. Um, it's not that the university doesn't want to offer you housing, it's just that that's how it's done in every single city in the Netherlands. Even if you go through such hard situations, uh, you don't have to give up and you must not give up, actually. My friend found a room uh, going to a party and yes, it sounds ridiculous, but it happens. And a good thing here is that you actually meet a lot of international students and a lot of international people who are he here to help you. And if you talk to them, maybe you can find uh, a friend of theirs who is moving out and you can move in.